you know me. Maintaining a sense of wonder from the original 1993 movie, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom delivers a strong animal rights message that manages to be smart, scary, and even emotionally resonant. The newest Jurassic sequel follows the cast of the previous movie, Jurassic World, after their escape from the original Jurassic Park Island, as it slowly is consumed by lava from an erupting volcano. After the United States Senate decided it would be a waste of money to try and save them, the dinosaur's only hope of survival from the volcano is Claire Deering, played by Bryce Dallas Howard. Do you remember the first time you saw a dinosaur? And this premise doesn't lack the social commentary as co-writer Colin Trevorrow points out in a 2016 Time interview. He says, the dinosaurs will be a parable of the treatment animals receive today. The abuse, medical experimentation, pets, having wild animals in zoos like prisons, the use the military has made of them, animals as weapons. And like all good parables, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom doesn't belabor its point or become preachy. It simply makes it through its story. Fortunately, it has a damn good story. But it's not without some flaws. It's not hard to guess which characters will live and die pretty much on sight, but thankfully Fallen Kingdom alternates between pulse-pounding tension and sweet narrative catharsis. Even better, by the time the credits are rolling, it's clear the dinosaur's prehistoric adventures are going to take place in the midst of human civilization from this point forward. It only took them five movies to get us to this long overdue point, but better late than never. Fallen Kingdom manages to stray away from the humans caught in the jungle running from dinosaurs trope in a refreshing way, and it even captures similar feelings of awe from the original Jurassic Park, making it one of the best sequels to date.